Food has always been my passion. We've been leaders in culinary arts education in Minnesota since 1942. My knife skills have become much better. There's a lot of things you do hands-on that you get to do and you get to see first, first and experience. The industry is kind of trending towards uh, a more holistic and healthful food as well. I looked at the location, accreditation, um, and then what the course was were offering for the program, and it, and it seems well-rounded and pretty solid. We look at things like uh, caloric reduction, uh, different uh, cooking techniques that we can utilize to reduce uh, harmful facets of food, cutting fat, cutting sodium, uh, increasing uh, dietary fiber, things of that nature. And uh, once again, using fresh seasonal ingredients. It's all what a student wants to learn. If he wants to learn something more than what's offered here, the instructor will actually go through and, and talk to you and maybe put some more homework on your, on your plate, you know, so to speak. When I came in kind of feeling a little bit like I was a little behind, um, they took some time out to help me and kind of help me along the way and get me caught up. Students that uh, come to us with food science backgrounds that are doing product testing, uh, for General Mills, running delis. We have students that are doing conventional restaurant work and working their way up the ladder that way. We have graduates that go into food service management positions, uh, food and beverage management positions. Uh, there's just a, a number of different opportunities and you can really uh, take uh, our base education and kind of skew it however you want. We're more than happy to have prospective students come in and trail and talk to our students and talk to our faculty as well. Because they do have a really great reputation in the community. It's the most reasonably priced program that's around here in the metro area. Mm -hmm.